Gather up, Astrophiles. Top 10 World has brought you some amazing facts about outer space that you haven't heard yet. There, that, that, that's it. That's the wormhole. You say it, don't spray it. We hope you'll love to watch it. A massive universe hovers less than 100 miles above our heads, vaster than we could possibly imagine. It's teeming with extraordinary events that our feeble minds can scarcely comprehend. Can you imagine phenomena like stars within stars, diamond-encrusted planets, white holes, or even atom-sized black holes? Let's start with one of the most amazing facts. You guys must have felt the warm rays of the sun shining on your face. But let me tell you a secret about it. The sun does not burn. Yes, you've heard right. This big ball of hot gas above our heads does not burn, but it glows. The term burning refers to a chemical reaction involving the rearrangement of electrons in an atom. However, our sun, that is composed of hydrogen and helium gases, uses a process called nuclear fusion. That means instead of the atoms being rearranged, the very nature of the element changes. Instead of burning the hydrogen, Mr. Sun converts gigantic quantities of it into helium and energy. According to NASA, approximately 300 million tons of energy a minute is released. Oh, somebody's hotter than Selena Gomez. I'm pretty sure this discovery has left you amazed, but we have another one and you would not want to miss this one. You've surely seen images from space that prove our globe is unquestionably spherical. However, appearances can deceive. Because this huge blue stone isn't perfectly spherical, and before all the flat earthers interrupt, no, it's not a pancake either. Now let me explain what this big blue marble actually is. The globe rotates, producing a centrifugal force that's greater near the equator and virtually non-existent at the poles. As the mass is distributed unevenly, the equatorial part of the globe is dragged outwards by the force. This gives the Earth a somewhat squished look, as if it had been sat on by mistake. There's a 26-mile hump that's almost as big as the lie that flat earthers tell themselves. Let's move on to the next fact. I'm sure you'll be surprised to hear this. Do you know that our sun may be quite heavy? Yet if it were preparing for a physical combat with the other stars in our cosmos, it'd be categorized as a lightweight. Now you must be wondering which star is heaviest. Well, the colossal but uninspiring titled R136A1 would sit at the top of the super heavyweight lineup across the ring. This massive star is believed to have 315 times the mass of our sun, or you can say it's almost 105 million Earths. This star carries huge amounts of ionized helium, carbon, and nitrogen. It's because of these super heavy elements, the giant star has unimaginable mass and intense glow. The glow is so intense that if it were compared side by side to our sun, then it would outshine it as much as our sun outshines the moon. R136A1 may appear to be massive, but it's actually rather tiny, with the diameter just 35 times that of our sun. It's more like Michelle to the universe's Beyonce. And although Beyonce may be the most famous person on the planet, U.S. Gatai is the biggest star known to man. Now you must be wondering that if it's so large, why aren't we constantly blinded by it? Well, for our eyes, it's located in the Scutum constellation in the Milky Way galaxy around 5,219 light years from Earth. If you're so amazed to know this, then we have another fact that'll blow your mind. When it comes to planets with a lot of diamonds, all the other gas giants should make way for 55 Cancri E. Scientists began studying the content of this when it was discovered in the Crete constellation in 2004. They found that this planet had to be composed of dense carbon compounds like graphite and in extreme cases, diamond. But it wasn't simply a couple of necklaces. According to scientists, a thick coating of pure diamonds protects the planet's core layers accounting for one-third of its mass. Doesn't it sound pretty valuable? Despite the fact that it's an ultra-wealthy utopia, there's practically nothing remarkable about it. The hostile climate makes this planet an exotic diamond in the rough since the surface temperature reaches a flush-melting 3,900 degrees Fahrenheit. Let's move on to the next fact. A cold and dark pointed space known as the Kuiper Belt exists beyond the planets of our solar system. The large objects in the Kuiper Belt have trajectories that are a little lopsided. While they all continue to circle the sun, the furthest objects all appear to be swinging awkwardly in one direction. The unevenness, however, should be impossible according to astrophysical principles. However, experts have proposed that their wacky paths could make sense. That is, unless there's a massive unknown planet balancing them out in the opposite way. According to their estimates, the ninth planet would need to have a mass of roughly 10 times that of Earth. This ghost planet remains completely speculative. What do you think about the existence of Planet X? Let us know in the comments. Let's figure out with a little math just how long it would take to count every single star in the sky. 
let's start at a galaxy level. Some calculations indicate our Milky Way galaxy holds between 100 and 400 billion stars. Next, we need to figure out how many galaxies there are in the universe. An astronomer named David Kornreck has proposed a rough estimate of around 10 trillion different galaxies. Multiply that by our 100 billion stars per galaxy estimate, and you get approximately 1 septillion stars and a lot of stardust trailing behind it. So now, what do you think how long it would take for you to count every single star in the sky? Well, assuming you count one a second, it would take you over 31 quadrillion years to pinpoint them all. Let's leave it to NASA. Some supernova remnants can leave something genuinely terrifying in their wake. When the outward force of heat pressure against gravity no longer exists in the surviving stellar cores of massive exploding stars, the core collapses in on itself. A black hole is the name given to this improbable event. When a star collapses in on itself, its rapidly shrinking surface approaches the event horizon. This is the point at which the speed required to escape the collapsing star's gravity exceeds the speed of light. This implies that everything moving slower than 186,000 miles per second gets pulled in and devoured by the gravitational well. Unlike stars, black holes have no limits. They can be as small as a single atom and sometimes even larger than the planets. Black holes have some neglected twins termed as white holes. A white hole spews matter out. All evidence points to their developing in the opposite direction of their black hole relatives. As a result, rather than collapsing in on themselves, a highly dense singularity would vomit out matter till it popped into a star. However, because no white holes have been discovered in the known universe, they remain strictly theoretical saying that black holes were only a hypothesis until 1971, perhaps a rogue white hole will offer some light on the subject in the next 50 years. At school, you probably learned that the most amazing feature of Saturn was its stunning set of rings. But if you look closer, you'll see an even more mind-blowing side to this planet. At the north pole of this gas giant, a huge hexagonal storm is constantly raging. It was first discovered in 1988 in footage from the Voyager probes, it's about 20,000 miles wide and 60 miles deep, with winds whipping around at approximately 220 miles per hour. It was found that the currents jostled with one another and meandered into the hexagonal shape. All right, guys, that's it for today's video. Which of these amazing space facts really blew you away? Let us know in the comments below. If you like this video, don't forget to hit that like button and share this video with your friends. We'll be back with another video.